It's ROG Rig Reboot 2021, this time featuring an actual child. Yes. You claim to have been watching my videos for five years, but I don't believe you. You would have been in the womb at that point. Of age or not, Tucker's gonna be building his very third, fourth PC? My expectations are extremely high. What should I be doing with my hands? <laughs> My current setup right now is uh, an old Dell. It's running at i5-8400, I believe, and a 1050 Ti. It crashes and turns off and on randomly, sometimes crashes multiple times in the same hour. I could have it be running a, a game that's too hard for it and it'll crash, or I could have a Word document open and it crashes. For my build, I'm hoping for something that's gonna help me do my projects and run everything I need it to do. Well, do you wanna see it? Yes. Then go ahead and pull it off. Oh, like you mean it, Tucker. <laughs> I tried, okay? I mean, oh, dude, I... So, you're a bit of an electronics whiz kid, is my understanding. Oh, yeah. I built an arcade machine. I built an electric skateboard that can go around 30 kilometers an hour, and I've been trying to build a spot welder, but it's been going a little rough. <laughs> um, it exploded. <laughs> I really appreciated your application video where you actually soldered the composite video input on one of those old clamshell DVD players so you could use it as a monitor. My first idea was to build a breadboard computer with little microprocessors, but I had an old laptop and the screen was destroyed so I got an old DVD player and I managed to hack a composite video signal into it. So you could show it to me right now? It's not here. What is here is your brand new machine. Do you recognize any of this stuff? What do we got here? That is expensive. We've got your CPU right here. We've got your graphics card. We've got your SSDs. Yes, Look SSDs. At this. There's so many of them. I'm not gonna get away with any of this with you, am I? No. All right, prove it. What do you start with? This one, really, the monitor. Oh, what? It says ProArt on it right here. It, wait, am I wrong? <laughs> Now, Tucker's not as much of a hardcore gamer as even some of our previous contestants, perhaps because his computer's not really up to it, but he is an aspiring creative. So you do some video editing, is that right? Yes. What else do you get up to? 3D modeling and CAD and gaming. You know, I do some modeling myself. I need a CPU. You do? I do. If you find it, you can have it. Okay. I actually don't see it. That's not it. It's not here. Oh man, this computer isn't gonna work very well, Tucker, because I'm taking away your- oh. <laughs> That is a large CPU box. That is a fast CPU. We're gonna be equipping this ProArt Z690 with Intel's 12th gen Alder Lake 12900K. That's right, my friends, eight performance cores, eight slightly less performance cores, 24 threads, this is like a piece of architecture, this box. It's kind of like computer porn. It's just computer porn though, Dad. It's not like the other kind. The only weird thing is we're all looking at it together. <laughs> this thing looks really cool. I'm gonna try to do this without breaking anything. I think you got this. I'm not exactly sure how to get it in there. The... And now I think I need to push this down and then do this. Oh. Whoa! Is that supposed to happen? I don't know, it depends. How much of a working computer do you want, Tucker? Okay, should I think, keep pushing this? ASUS asked me to mention a couple of things about this board, like it's uh, 16 plus one phase power delivery, quadruple Gen 4 M.2 drive support, and of course, support for PCIe Gen 5 in the 16X slot up here. Not to mention it's ample I.O. We got 10 gig and two and a half gig LAN and dual Thunderbolt ports, including dual DisplayPort inputs. So that means that you can actually take your dedicated graphics card, which is gonna be a pretty fast one, and you can inject DisplayPort into your Thunderbolt output so you're not stuck with onboard video for those. What the bananas? All of the USB ports are 10 gig ports. Dang, this thing has everything. Didn't PCIe Gen 4 just come out and now it's on five? Now we're on five. Interesting. Oh, <laughs> terrible. <laughs> Tucker. I did it. Tucker, you really talked that one up. I think it's either the memory or the cooler. I actually probably wouldn't install the cooler right now. That's a genuine tech tip. Would you know about being cool? 
Um, so you got some pretty nice Is memory. there four of them? 16 gigs, so that is a total of 64 gigs of DDR5. One of these sticks is significantly more impressive than what's in my current computer. Literal garbage PC. Oh, it's like creaking. I don't want to press too hard. <laughs> it's like creaking. I think I got it. I think you got it too. So at that point, if I say I believe in you, am I saying I believe that you won't fail or I believe that you will? I don't know. You're throwing my stickers. I need those. Oh, oh, it's <laughs> awful. The entire community is so sad right now. Yes. You know what, I'm just gonna, yep, double check. Okay, yep, go you for it. You push on everything so hard. It, look, it definitely sounds like it's breaking. You want me to show you broken? What's next? I think I want to put the motherboard into the case. I want. You know, there's a little movie called Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory. I don't think putting this in is gonna kill me. You're gonna wanna put your storage on it first. I, I'm used to a SATA drive, so you don't put them on the motherboard. We do have one of those. Okay. We have everything. That's ROG Rig Reboot. There's not even that much ROG going on in this one. What the heck? We got a ProArt motherboard, we got a... I need a screwdriver. Tough. LTTstore.com? Yeah, it's yeah. the new LTT one. It's a prototype, it's not quite right. All right, you're gonna want... There you go. So you put it that way, then you use this whenever you don't need a ton of force. Yeah. There you I know go. how screwdrivers work. Do you? No. Oh, I got it. I did it. I'm smart. Okay. That's now a lie. I'm gonna screw no, it you're in. not done yet. Well, I, I'm working on it, okay? No, you're, you're not working on anything. Tucker, put that away. Watch yeah. this. Toolless. Oh. Boom. I don't even need the screws. Whoa, right? I bet you can do it one handed. Look at him go. I'm a professional. P5 plus one terabyte SSD installed. Look at this kid showing off with his soldering skills. Forgets to Wait. take the sticker off. You like stickers on your case, Tucker? I do. Here you go, enjoy. Oh, that is awful. Boom. We're gonna put all the stickers on your case, Tucker. Well, this is great. Now I wanna put this in there. You know what I wanna do? I wanna take off these peels before they're hard to get at. I wanna do it. Too late, you started this. Okay. You have no one to blame but yourself. Oh yeah. Oh, wait, what? This is a very large case. This is a mid tower. You're just a very small, young boy. Okay. Oh, this is heavy. Yeah, I don't know if it's that heavy. Is this the one of the cases where you can just put this in? Mm hmm I mean, I would probably get your mounting hardware somewhat ready first. If, I mean, oh, you can- I don't think that matters. Okay, that is not <laughs> on though. Let me at least help okay. you. Okay. Okay. There. Thank you. Sure. Wonderful. These are organized really nice. Yeah, Fantex does a great job of that. Now you mentioned that you don't watch TikTok. I thought that's like your whole generation's jam. Why would I watch TikTok when I can watch you build computers? You can't get a second computer, Tucker. This is solid. It, it is, it is a solid. It is neither a liquid nor a gaseous power supply. You just put the box away, don't need the cables. You don't, because yeah. Chase is going to get fancy oh, cables, right. unless they're not here, in which case, yeah, we'll get them. I was trying to beat your score saber score. There's no way you're gonna beat me in beat saber. I'm like within 100 ranks of you in Canada, but I can't get any higher, because the computer, it doesn't do the do. What do you think, has Tucker got what it takes? Can he challenge these wrists? Good luck, Tucker. Keep in mind, I have not used these controllers before. Uh-huh. Oh, Ooh, hit the table. Yeah, we should probably, I think that's a, that's a mulligan right there. <laughs> really intense map. Well, let's see if I can get through this thing. I actually don't think I can. All right, you still got a bit to learn, Grasshopper. Okay. I think I gave it my best shot, but I didn't really think I had any chance at beating Linus at Beat Saber. Get wrecked. What, you thought I was gonna high five you? Nobody I high fives know. anymore. What would you like to do? I saw another SSD. I think I'm gonna try to put it in. Four terabytes. I thought SSDs this size only went up to two terabytes. No. I think we have like a 30 terabyte one Ooh. coming in for our petabyte of flash project that is coming up. Get subscribed. You don't actually have to do that, what you're doing. I don't? Nope. Oh, that's nice. Zero tools. Why are you here, Lionel? Hey! All right, just two of these screws has gotta be lots. Unlike your current storage situation, this has no moving parts and therefore. Have you ever experienced high resolution, high refresh rate gaming? Yes. You were at LTX. Yeah. So you actually know how to build a computer because our expo taught you how. Yeah. The system works. It does work. Let's have a look at the cables that you'll be plugging into it. You ready? They match your hoodie. Ooh. 
this is for the motherboard, right? Oh, it's flipping over. Don't screw up. Oh, I'm. Do you like some light? Look at me being helpful during an ROG rig reboot. He must like you or something. He's a kindred spirit. Not different than you. I said kindred spirit, did I not? Now, we got all of this stuff dealt with in here. Let's get this radiator mounted. Here. Ooh. Where are your fans at, Tucker? There. Ow. Who's? Oh, crap. Now, this is a really cool AIO cooler. Not only does it have a screen on it, it comes with some of the finest fans on the market, the NFF12 Industrial PPC 2000 RPM. So what's the first game you're gonna play on this rig? Definitely Half-Life Alex. Have you tried to play it on your current rig? The frame rate is not good for motion sickness. That makes sense. On a 1050, <laughs> that would not be a great experience. How close did you get to upchucking? You know what, Tucker? I think this might be the fastest ROG rig reboot build that we've done yet. Can you stop that? I want to plug it in. What about, Tucker, what I want? What do you do with the rest of my PCI Express cables here? They're up here. Oh, RTX 3080. 10 gigs RAM. He will not be doing any mining as much as he might be a miner. Ah! I'm gonna drop this. You know how hard these are to get? My precious. This is massive. Botch this peel. Yeah, you botched it already. <laughs> wow, that happened really fast. Oh my gosh. Thought you were a nice kid, not a brutal monster. I, I don't think anything you're saying is at all relevant. What are you doing, Tucker? Taking this out. Do you need a screwdriver? I do have one. No. You got a bit of a compatibility crisscross, so you got to make sure that you put it in at just the right angle. What? I mean, that's not how I would have done it. Now they're going to cross. Oh, I'm not doing that. Yeah, you don't want to cross your streams. I feel like streams. that was a reference, but I don't understand. You need to use the Sarah Butt patented technique. So we're just going to kind of we'll kind of oh give my. it a ah, you know, oh. kind of bend it a little. When he was reefing on the graphics card, it did not look good. <laughs> yeah, no. should be fine. Okay. There you go. I found more stickers. Oh, excellent. Okay. I'm putting it here. Nice. Who needs airflow anyway? Steve from Gamers Nexus dislikes this. That is awful. Oh, nice. Good find. Whoa, magnets. Not my finest cable management ever, but it's what you're getting. Oh, I scratched it. Um, I'm gonna take 5% off the price of the computer for you, okay? That really helps. Do you wanna power it on? Do the honors? Yeah. Let's do it. Oh, we didn't even talk about your monitor yet. 1440p Pro Art, so super color accurate. Still 75 hertz though, so it's like that fine line between like, you know, creation ready monitor, but also gaming capable. How's that display looking, by the way? Yeah, that's higher resolution than the DVD player. That is probably true, actually. Like 480 it, I think I'd, it actually yeah. is true. All right, what do you think? Is it gonna fire up for us though? Who plugged in an HDMI cable? Oh, this, is, this is what happens when you let Chase run the cables. I told him DisplayPort, he didn't listen. Oh, you got called out! I wanna catch it, no look. Really? Oh, well, that's a bad sign. It just powered off like that. Um... Maybe it's from your reefing on the graphics card. Maybe it's not a very attractive quality to play the blame game. Okay, I do actually need this to <clears throat> power on though. Oh. Yay! Woo! Ah, yes! The big moment, cover your eyes. And there it is. That is incredible. That's the most beautiful computer I've ever seen. I will always be watching you. We didn't even attempt to put it in the center or anything. <laughs> it's just there. You can't even see your screen on your CPU cooler. I mean, who needs that anyway, right? Go for it. Do something. Compute. All right, show us how it's done. I actually don't play racing games either. I'm doing it, I'm driving. Yeah, yeah, I mean. Whee! It's good looking though, hey? Yeah, it looks really good. Extreme preset, baby. Oh boy. And I'm crashing. That's rough. But that's okay, because you are ahead of everyone else who submitted an entry for ROG Rig Reboot. If you enjoyed this video, maybe check out one of our previous ROG Rig Reboots. And this is it, this is where you say hi mom. Hi mom. Thanks to LTT and Asus ROG for the new rig.